and just rotate it. You'll see, and it, it will. All right, all right. What's up, guys? We're uh, we're live. If you saw the thumbnail and you're wondering why I was making face, it's because I spilled some water and then tried to catch it with my foot because uh, I forgot to hold something up to the camera to make it, I don't know, somewhat visually appealing. I don't know if it was, but here we are. Um, I have four, I have four packages to open here real quick. And I was told that one of them would be great for my show or potentially for my show. I don't actually don't remember what they said, if it would be great or not, but something to do with my show. And since I might be able to use it for my show and my show is tomorrow, I figured I'd open it. And since there's four, I figured I would do a, a live gift opening like I always do. Also, just over here, who doesn't want to be on camera is Amy. And she just told me my fly was open. So there we go. Good first impressions on my part. No, she's trying not to laugh or pretending to try not to laugh or something. Uh, I am looking for a knife, which I also forgot have to take. Okay, give me one second. So over the last, like, oh, it's buffering. Of course it's buffering. Why wouldn't it buffer? It is happening right now, Renee. Is it still fuzzy? Should I start over? I don't know. Perfect. Okay, we're good. Beverly Settle, thank you. Good picture now. Perfect. Okay, good, good, good. Sorry about that. I always forget about that. I'm used to the internet sucking, and since it doesn't get fuzzy on my side, I don't, I don't notice it. Uh, but anyway, my show is tomorrow. I don't know which one of these is for, uh, supposedly for my show, but I'm gonna open all of them, and then I'm gonna get back to work. Uh, yeah, doing, got lots to do still. So this one is from Canada. Doesn't say who it's from, so I'm gonna open it here. Oh, there's a thing inside. Okay. This is from... Oh, this is from Martha. It says, Hot Dogs in the Stars. Seems fitting for your show. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, this is from my wardrobe. These are hot dog socks. Uh, sending my best wishes for a fabulous show. Hope you sell lots from Martha. Thank you so much, Martha. I'm definitely going to wear these tomorrow. <laughs> Hot dogs in space. Who even would think of this besides me? And they got mustard. Kind of matches. Hold on. Let me grab this. Kind of matches this thing. Look at this hot dog. It used to be stuck in there, but it was swelled with water, and so now it's now it's loose because it's dried out. But this is gonna be at my show. It's not really a piece of the art to like, I don't expect anyone to buy this. This is ridiculous, but it'll be there. This was kind of an afterthought as a, as a, like a kind of a joke. And since I made that, I decided to make a few other things to go with that series. I didn't want it to be kind of by itself as a like, why is this hot dog here? I guess it kind of makes sense because of the new series of paintings that I'm going to have there, which I don't have any here. So if you haven't seen them, check out my Instagram, which, I think there's a link in the description somewhere. Um, so I also made another bundle of dynamite, which you guys would have seen when I did Landon's, when we staged his home, after I went to that one hoarder house with Alex, if you guys remember that vlog, the, the right after that, I did a, a painting for his wall and then a, a trio of dynamite sticks. Anyways, I made another one of those for the show it, I thought I would put it on the coffee table that may also be there, but the glass, I'm having trouble with the glass getting cut. I had Ken come by and he, uh, he, you can't get it? All right. Oh, I wonder if actually that's my key. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Maybe try this. Try, maybe try this. It says four it on it, but I bet you that's mine. Sorry guys, give me one second. Give me one second. Gramps, 
needs to leave and I need to find him a key. I'll be right back. Uh, the I was going to say you could take my car. Really? Yeah. yeah. I'm not going far. All right. If, if you trust him, I mean, you should see how he drives. If I don't come back. You know he's on the run. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah. good luck with with the uh, with the trip. Cool. Anyway, okay, I'm back. I'm back, guys. I'm back. Um, by the way, there's a new Just Joshing with Dakota out on the Just Joshing with Dakota channel. Uh, put it out yesterday. I forget what I was saying. Oh yeah, so I made. Dynamite, and then I made a camera, like a reel-to-reel -reel video camera. If you're watching my uh, Ushita Instagram lives where I made the uh, chicken, the the metal chicken, Gramps was messing around with it a little bit. Anyways, I got that. And uh, I think it's just the three, because in the show, I have my, uh, for example, right here, I have my, right here, I have my animal series, right? But I, I have the space series, and then the animal series, and then I have my x-ray series, and then I have my, uh, here's a new one. I have my sports figures, uh, then I have the musicians, and you know, so on and so forth, all the different ones. And so I kind of want it to look like the show is featuring multiple artists, but all the artists are me in the end. That's kind of what I'm going for. I don't know if that really makes sense, but but hopefully it makes sense. Um, hold on, Henry might be harassing. Amy, give me one second. Are you being good? Yes, he was going in. Okay. Sorry, I'm scattered all over the place. Thank you, Renee, for sharing that. Wishing you an amazing show. Tomorrow, Josh, all the fun, all the sales, all the recognition you deserve. Well, thank you very much. Karen, hello, Josh. I'm in the airport in Toronto on my way to Edmonton. Sick. Thanks for coming. And thank you to everyone who is coming. This one's also from Amazon. Let's see if there's a note in here. Also from Martha, says, Josh, I've sent two sets, one for you, one for Dakota. These are new and supposed to write well on most surfaces. Dakota had trouble writing on his clay sculpture, so hopefully these work better. Enjoy from Martha. Thank you so much. These are uh, all the colors, it looks like. Sharpie markers, but I guess specifically geared towards artists rather than just your regular... Uh, Marker, are they oil or are they alcohol-based or water-based? I don't know. Yeah, we'll we'll try these out. Thank you. I'll make sure to go to get those. He's going to come later today. Uh, funny enough to draw a doodle on some couches. Maybe both of them, maybe just one of them. I'm not sure just yet. Uh... Karen, are you going to the show? She is coming to the show. Okay, this one is from Canada as well. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Let's. Let's see what the note is. Also from Martha. <laughs> Happy birthday, Josh. Hope you enjoyed the music from Martha. Oh, this is a C. Oh, snap! She sent me uh, some Pink Floyd. Dark Side. Oh, multiple. The Wall. This is a great album. Also a great album. Probably because she saw me. Uh, probably because she saw me painting this. Which, by the way, is a sick painting. Oh, sorry about that glare. There we go. Uh, if you watched my Instagrams as I was uh, at, leading up to the show, which is tomorrow, um, 
you will have seen this. I think I also just shared it on Instagram as well. It's probably on the Facebook page. This is actually already sold, so it won't be at the show. There will be a print at the show, but but the, the actual original will not will not be there. Hold on, let me put this up here, just for some vid visual intrigue. You know. There we go. There we go. Thank you so much, Martha. I will definitely enjoy those. I have a bunch of CDs in the shop. We have this uh, stereo in there, which we had meant to hook up to all the speakers that we have all over the place. Uh, but it's not my stereo, and I'm not going to buy speaker wire for it. Because it's not mine. And I feel like whoever owns it should, but they don't feel like doing it either, I guess. Or he never got around to it. Okay, this last one is from Justine. Let me give it a... Let me give it a... Slice and dice here. To Josh Joshington, that's a, uh, that's a, uh, I don't actually know how that started, but I think Matthew Fox, our moderator, our other moderator, uh, started that for some reason, somehow, somewhere, I don't actually know, or maybe Justine started that, but we got, we have, the, remember that newspaper from, I can't remember which vlog, shit, I can't remember, but, uh, it's called the Joshington Post because of whatever this Josh Joshington or Joshington Lincoln, I guess it was, or Abraham, wait, George Joshington. Or jo you know what? I actually don't remember what they all are, but anyway. Uh, oh, this is a birthday thing. Thank you. You're talented, rare, and awesome. Happy birthday. She says, happy birthday and all good wishes for the year ahead. You are an inspiration and greatly appreciated by so many of us around the world. Well, thank you for the kind words. I appreciate that. And I'm glad that I inspire you. I have no idea what just happened. That, that's so weird. Okay, you didn't miss anything, good. Phew. I have no idea how that happened. I literally didn't touch anything and it just... Are you guys good now? Can you see me? Am I here? I'll wait for you. Gosh darn it. Let me, uh... Good now? Okay. There we go. It looks like, sounds like there's, a, or it looks like there's a delay. Okay, I don't need this thing. Okay. Wow, what a bummer. Anyways, Justine sent this. Uh, and thank you for the card. I don't know if you heard me read it, but but uh, thank you. Okay. Oh, you're the third person to send me this. Thank you. Now I got one in the house, one in the studio, one in the library, you know, that's going to be right out those doors one day. Probably not anymore, but we'll see. Uh, and then she sent some stickers. Hot diggity dog. Oh, and she sent me a patch, a heart patch. You know, someone else sent me one of these and I got the perfect jacket to put one of them on. And now I have two, so I gotta find another jacket. I just never put it on. I think these are kind of the kind that you can iron. So I should just do that at some point. And then stickers. And then just the lots of, this is obviously candy. I've never tried these before. Are these like Swedish fish, but lobsters instead? Oh, they are like Swedish fish. I don't know what that is. You don't like them? <laughs> I do. Thank you. But now I've tried them. You don't like candy or what? 
You don't like candy. We have an alien here. For those who missed it, Amy is just off camera here. Mrs. Robertson, which is always in the comment section, which you guys may recognize. Okay, this says open carefully. Okay, it says eye color brown. Wait. Antique prosthetic eye number 15. What the heck? Do you have these? Uh -huh. Yeah, you have a bunch, right? I have a jar of them. Oh, it's tapes. So for those of you who don't know, I love oddities. I don't have very many of Oh, that looks so cool. I don't want it to fall. That looks just like a freaking eye. Obviously, that's what it's supposed to be. A glass eye. You know what? For some reason, I thought a glass eye would be the whole ball. I don't know why I never thought that it would just be half a... It's like a hemisphere. That's because there's meat in there. Of course there is, yeah. But for some reason, I thought it would be... Because you know, like... You hear about stories of people getting their eye knocked out and it rolls across the floor. How does it roll across the floor if it's this? It really would scatter across the floor. Hopefully it doesn't happen. Would that be embarrassing? If your eye fell out? I don't know. If you're embarrassed by stuff like that. Yeah, but I mean, people are embarrassed about, you know, all sorts of things, right? So would they be embarrassed about, I don't know. I think it would be hilarious. You know when people's teeth fall out. Okay. Oh, also a book for Ashley. Ashley's not here right now. She just went to work. Oh, Gramps is back. Uh, but she said, For Ashley, I hope you enjoy this novel as much as I did, based on true events in 1938. Be sure to Google what the modified truck looked like for moving to two giraffes cross-country. West with... Oh, West with Giraffes. She will definitely like this book. I feel like I recognize this cover, so she might actually already have it, but I'm not certain. Thank you. Oh! And a big chocolate bar. Do you like chocolate? You don't like chocolate? Dark, 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 like 80%. That's all you like? <clears throat> That's what I enjoy. Wait, so you like candy that doesn't taste good? Okay. I like salt. Oh, so you probably like dropies. Never heard of that. They're like licorice, like this stuff, but like salty as can be. I like salt tart, not sweet chocolate. Oh my god. This I lady. Know. This lady over here, guys. I think that's everything. I don't want to miss anything in case there's... Yeah, that's it. Thank you, Justine. And Martha. Uh, I'm going to try this real quick. How do you not like chocolate? What the heck? Wait. Patricia also doesn't like chocolate. Patricia, who's also always in the comments. It's pretzel. It's a pound. This tastes freaking delicious. Want to try some? Is it? Pretzel chocolate? Yeah, sure. Give me one square. One square. By the way, guys, Gramps is here. They can't see you, though. Oh, that, yeah, perfect. Um, okay, that's everything. I wanted to make sure that I opened this. So I could get whatever it was that was for the show. I will definitely wear these tomorrow. I'll also be wearing a spacesuit, which um, is orange, which won't match these at all. So maybe they'll just super stand out. Actually, you won't even see my feet. What are some space shoes that I could wear? Like moon boots or something? <laughs> 
Also, I need. To, I still need to make the freaking mannequin. I still need to make Stan. Okay. Um, I am going to leave it there. So once again, thank you, everyone. If you want to come to the show tomorrow, it's from four to eight at Sterling Gallery in Londonderry Mall, not West Hampton Mall. I have a feeling people are going to go to the West Hampton Mall and be like, wait. Oh, it's going to be at the other West Hampton Mall location. They're going to walk over there and they're going to be like, wait, this looks normal. You'll have to get in your car, drive north and a little east, all the way to the ghetto, coming to that mall. It's not really ghetto, I'm just kidding, but I never go there. So, and my brother used to live there and it was pretty ghetto where he lived. So, you know, I call it the ghetto. It's not very ghetto -y though. At least not with the true sense of the word. Anyways, it's going to be at Londonderry Mall on the lower level, Sterling Gallery. It's going to be sick. Uh, and if you're there, it'll be even better. There's going to be like free food. In fact, you guys are on a charcuterie board right now. It's 24 inches by 35 inches. So imagine all that filled with stuff. There's going to be free dogs. There's going to be free drinks. There's going to be music. So come through. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I wish that there was like a button where I could just be like, and that'd be a great sign off, but I always have to do this. <laughs> Jules is jealous.